Hey, what's up, guys? Let's go over the three most common mistakes that I see beginner bodybuilders um, fall victim to. The first one is using too heavy a weight. Let's say you're working biceps. Instead of doing a strict curl that just emphasizes the bicep, they start swinging using their whole body, and it works the biceps some, but you're working muscles you don't intend to do, often leads to injury. So the first one is you don't have slow, controlled form that emphasizes just the muscle you're working because they use too heavy a weight. The second thing I can see a lot of people do is they don't emphasize, emphasize the top part of the lift. So if you're going to say a curl, you come up at the very top, you want to squeeze for say a, a two count. Because never forget, you never get the peak contract, you only get the peak contraction at the peak contraction. So if you want that muscle, that bicep to ball up, you want to come up and then squeeze for a two count and come back down. Because again, in bodybuilding, it's different power lifting. You want no momentum involved. You want the muscle doing all the lift and then back down. And the third and final one is people, beginners a lot of times don't emphasize the negative part of the lift. They think a lift is just up and they let it down. Up and let it down. But often it's that negative side that the concentric, the eccentric, the negative going down that really stretches and breaks down that muscle. Because never forget, the whole goal of bodybuilding and weightlifting is to break down the muscle. When you feed it with nutrients, good protein, and rest, that's when the muscle recovers and gets bigger and stronger. But the first thing you want to do when you're in the weight room is break the muscle down. So for example, a curl, you're coming up slow, thousand one, thousand two, back down slow, then start back over, up, down two, and back down. So make sure if you're just starting out with any kind of workout program, you don't fall victim to those three things. Too heavy a weight, not emphasizing the peak contraction, and not emphasizing the, the negative side of the lift. Hope this helps you guys. Check out more videos coming 1010 Living. God bless you.